Welcome to REI Solutions. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a call flow in your profit dial setup and then assign that call flow to a number. Uh, you come to your settings and you'll see the opportunity here to add numbers and to upload recordings, but then also you'll see flows here. And this is where you'll come in and you'll actually create a new flow. And you can come in and you can name the flow, whatever it is. You can say live answer call flow. And this is where you can then decide what do you want to happen when uh, somebody dials that number. Um, you can forward it to a, another responder. You can add a greeting or a voicemail. Uh, you can do tagging to identify um, the leads that are coming in a particular way. You can uh, tick off an action set, which is just a series of to-dos or tasks uh, or actions related to that um, contact. And then you can do smart routing to actually identify um, first time callers or repeat callers. Um, you can set off stealth mail, uh, which allow you to actually do a, a automated direct to voicemail broadcast. And then you can even do text replies. Um, you can set up delays. You can even have an interactive menu if you want uh, somebody to press zero to go to a live responder. So there's a bunch of great stuff you can do here in, in building out your call flows. Um, but if you want, you know, just add a, a number. You can plug it right in here. And so you can forward it to your acquisitions manager and you'll know that they're um, going to get the call maybe after 20 seconds uh, of ring time. You can forward it to the next responder. Um, maybe you've got a third party service that you have supporting you and you can go ahead and forward it to them. And you could uh, determine you want to ring for a full minute there. Um, and then maybe it goes to a greeting uh, for a backup and you can go ahead and upload a recording and you can select that there and apply that to the call flow. And so there's a bunch of great stuff you can do with uh, creating your call flows. Um, I encourage you to come in here to the profit dial and start poking around. Uh, once you've saved and closed the, uh, that, you can see um, it's available then to assign to a number. And so you can actually come to your numbers and you'll see it available here in the drop down. You can select and apply that flow then to your tracking number. And so that's how you uh, will create and assign a flow in the profit dial. More to come.